Action news! Whoa! 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 That's right, it's a double whammy of Jules and Peter on the news channel. We've switched sides because we're talking about something completely different and we hope you wouldn't notice that. Now that you've said all that, I'm going to have to make sure that this one really does go out second and not, not first. That Very would be, true. That would be terrible. Very Continuity. true. What are we talking about, Tony Pete? Today we're talking about Hellboy. Okay. Are cool. you aware of Hellboy? Ron Perlman. Ron Perlman. What a guy. He's like a, a devil with his horns sawn off. He didn't need any f***ing makeup, that guy, did he, really? Oh my god, no. He, I mean, Ron Perlman, he's, he he's got like a unique look, hasn't he? Looked, he? he looked like the underside of a Timberland boot. Oh my like, god. That is, that is his face. Yeah, you're kind of right. He was in, uh, do you remember when he was in um, uh, Pacific Rim and played that, like, guy who chopped up kaiju? No, or he I didn't do it that. himself. He was like a kind of like a sort of kingpin. He was sort oh, of a gangster. Oh, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. He had yeah, like yeah. a stripey. He was like a tiger skin yeah. jacket. God, that was weird. Um, I don't know why I instantly went to Pacific Rim when I thought of Ron Perlman when he's been in all sorts of other things. Like before. Hellboy. Like Hellboy, yeah, for sure. But we're not talking about Ron Perlman oh, okay, or cool. indeed his replacement, uh, mm -hmm. who is David Harbour. We're talking about the uh, Professor Broom, who is in Hellboy who was played in the original by John Hurt of Alien fame. So we think we've got a casting for okay. Professor Broom mm -hmm. in Hellboy Rise of the Blood Queen. Whoa, what a title. Duh. That's cool. It's, it's looking like it's going to be Mr. Ian McShane. I'm drawing a blank. Who's Ian McShane? Ian McKellen, I know. Ian McShane. Are you a fan of Pirates of the Caribbean? Yeah, I liked one and two. Are you a of? fan of Pirates of the Caribbean 4? On Stranger there's Tides, a, there's a five, so don't there's even a, there's yeah. a five. Um, I'm going to go with a flat no. Yeah, I, I've not seen that. I stopped at the third one. Yeah, which I thought was, that was all it was. That's when most of the cast left. That's when um, Kira Knightley left, Orlando Bloom. Those acting powerhouses. Well, I mean, yeah, but they were, at least they were consistent in the first three. Yeah, just like drywall is consistent. Right, sure. <laughs> anyway, yeah. Um, he played Captain Blackbeard in uh, On Stranger Tides. Cool, good for him. Yeah. Uh, he's currently playing Mr. Wednesday in American Gods, the Neil Gaiman book that's on... Uh, they made a TV show oh, about it. I've seen that. I've heard good things. Though. Yeah, I've heard good things about that. I've not seen that. Uh, he also played Tai Lung in Kung Fu Panda. Whoa, really? Yeah. He played Tai Lung in Kung Fu... That's f***ing wicked! Yeah. He's... I mean... That's that guy? Yeah. Acting pedigree, right? Great. There. I mean, actually, you watched Battle of Britain with your mum recently, didn't you? I did. The Hi, 19. Mom. Hi, mum. The night. The 1969 version. I did, yeah. He played Sergeant Pilot Andy in that. And he's Lovejoy in Lovejoy, the uh, British sitcom about, well, it's not really a sitcom, it's like a comedy drama about um, an antiques dealer. God, I need to watch more TV, mate. Yeah, I, I mean, I, it's, it's, that's an old one. That's but it sound, like, sounds like he's got a varied sort of acting history. He has. So mm. according to the Hollywood, Hollywood Reporter, it's going to be Ian McShane cool. playing Prof Broom. Uh, this... I mean, you say, you know, he's got acting history. The actual, the people who are written in for this uh, film so far, it's looking pretty good. Okay, um, cool. hit me up with those deets. Well, the director, Neil Marshall. That's a familiar name, why he, do I know that? He did The Descent. Oh, right? what a good film. But he also did two episodes of Game of Thrones, both of which were, were absolutely stellar episodes. Do we know which ones? We do. Okay. He did... Up. Blackwater, which, spoiler oh. alert, was mm. the one where Tyrion Lannister was on the beach and mm. yeah, the, there was uh, the uh, wild, what was it called, wildfire? Yeah, something like that. Yeah. He also did Watchers on the Wall, which oh. was like the one where Castle Black gets attacked. That's you know that wicked. one that was just, wasn't that entirely set at Castle Black, that episode? But it I was think a lot it, of... It didn't cut away, it was just an in, like a, a whole, mm. a whole battle. So. He is a pretty good director in my yeah. book. Oh, definitely. And uh, David Harbour, he less well known, but he's he's done a lot of theatre. He was in Suicide Squad and Stranger Things. Love Stranger Things. Yeah. Wasn't a fan of Suicide Squad. No, but it was ex it was a successful movie. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah I don't yeah. think the acting was that bad in Suicide Squad. I think there were plenty of things wrong with it. It's um, weird to say that it's an Oscar-winning film. Is it? What did it win the Oscar for? Best makeup, or it won an award. I don't oh, know if it's wow. an award. Best it? makeup, that's not really a real Oscar, is it? If you're a makeup artist and you're watching that, direct your hate to Peter. So that's that's the news. Okay, Ian cool. McShane is going to be in Hellboy. It's going to be a much darker portrayal, apparently. Of um... it needed to be because right. the, the first, the reason that I didn't go and watch the second of the Hellboy films mm. was because the first one was just a little too silly for me. And I know right. that you're basically telling a story about a a half-demon 
with his horns cut off. It's going to be some levels of comic book silliness, but that was just a bit too... Like slapstick, I think it was too slapstick for me. It, there was definitely like comedy elements to mm. it, and yeah, maybe certainly the graphic novel is is pretty dark stuff. Oh god, it's very dark. And this is allegedly going to be much uh, sort of truer to the source material. So I'll be, I'll be uh, keeping an eye on that then, especially yeah. if it's got such names as uh, Ian, Mc- Ian McShane, Ian McShane, and uh, Neil Marshall, and, and Neil Marshall, and David Harbour, and David Harbour, of and, Suicide and Squad. Ron Perlman. Oh, unconfirmed, Ron Perlman. <laughs> Is playing Hellboy's dad. I that'd don't be, know. Oh, that'd be brilliant if it was. Does Hellboy have a dad? Hell, hell never changes. That was him. Hell doing dad. It. Oh, hell dad. That's that's the name for the sequel. Hell dad and Hellboy. Cool. Well, I've been Hell Jules, and I've been Hell Peter. And for all the rest of the Hellboy news, you can follow us on Hell Culture, and <laughs> subscribe. What culture? Same thing. What culture? Subscribe. Follow us for daily news and articles like this every goddamn day. Yeah. And we'll see you soon. Are we going to do a, a big crazy action news leave? I think I've got enough left in me. Three, two, one. Go! Oh! Oh!